Now, when you take your next holiday abroad, check into a hotel, a villa, lie on the beach, walk in the hills and buy a meal, it takes a bit of a leap of imagination to realise you have become a cog in the mighty machine of the tourism industry. Last year, there were well over a billion tourist arrivals around the world. Tourist spending power is immense. They spent an estimated $1.2 trillion last year. The world travel market opens in London today. 182 countries, that's almost all the countries in the world, uh, include regions as well, but they are scheduled to take part. There are going to be 5,000 exhibitors. They range from airlines to hotel companies, tourist boards, as well as firms dealing with all the other aspects of making a holiday happen. And between them, it is estimated they could agree about $3.1 billion worth of deals at this show, which helps put them in touch with one another. It is, in short, a very crowded marketplace. But with an industry this size, how do you make a mark? Haithamata is head of tourism for Ras al Khama, which is one of the seven emirates that makes up the United Arab, Arab Emirates, a region you might not immediately associate with tourism. How do you stand out? How do you make a difference? How do you, how do you say we're different from everyone else? It's, uh, it's, it's al always a, you know, a, um, a trick for you to stand out in the sea of sameness as we said before. Ras al Khaimah looks to stand out within you know, the, 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 uh, the markets or the tourism market for holiday makers across the, the globe. Uh, today we look at ourselves and how we compete across the globe with different destinations. We've got a lot to offer. We've got pristine beaches, 64 kilometers of pristine beaches. We've got year-round sun. And so has Turkey. Um, <laughs> Um, we've I mean, got, so have a lot of places. Yeah, absolutely. We've First got, the Caribbean. Absolutely. We've got great mountains uh, that are the highest in the UAE, and we also have a great culture and heritage and a lot of history as well. Now, what we have to offer as well is a great value for money. What we have that's different than many places out there in the world that are beachfront, four-star brands that are five-star product, but the price point is four star. Okay, how do you get over the Middle East tag, which people have rather, well, they don't have very good connotations, it doesn't have very good connotations. Well, it? the Middle East is, is quite big, right? I mean, it, there's 28 countries in the Middle East. Um, and for some uh, people out there uh, around the globe think the Middle East is one country, which isn't the, which isn't the case. And uh, in many cases, you know, troubles in the Middle East is, is quite far, very distant from where we are. Uh, and we are blessed with a, with a great geographical location of where we are in Ras al-Khaimah. As you know, part of the seven emirates, we are next to one of the strongest tourism brands in the world. Dubai has done a great job okay. in positioning itself, and we're only 45 minutes away from, from Dubai. A great sale. Thank you very much indeed. I'm afraid we're very pushed for time. We're going to have to leave it at Hatamata. Thank you very much indeed for that. And that is the business.